I've always really loved doing Noosa. It's, it's a race I've been doing for about nine years now, um, whether it be age group or professional. It's you know probably about two hours away from where I live. It's undoubtedly one of the biggest races in Australia. It's the name, the prestige associated with is, is absolutely huge. So it's one that I definitely want to win before my career is out. And yeah, one that I'll keep coming back to, I think long after my triathlon career has ended. So I woke up on race morning, the body felt good, ready to go. Um, quick warm up in the morning, just the usual slight jog, bit of a swim, and before you know it, it was ready to, ready to go. The swim was relatively, you know, quite quite calm, quite easy. Um, just kind of sat in the pack quite well. Um, just where I needed to be, sitting on the feet. As, as you kind of swim around, it's always a bit easier with the current. And then coming back, you're swimming against the current. I got out of the water and onto the bike feeling quite strong. Um, really ready to go and give it some. In the last couple of k's, I slightly dropped dropped off and lost the main pack, which is really frustrating. I've been struggling with a slight knee issue in the last few weeks leading up into the race, and I think that kind of really just you know put me back and just kind of felt the go all of a sudden, which was really really disappointing. As soon as I got to the run, I just knew you know it wasn't going to be the day that I had planned, unfortunately, and it's, it was a day where I just had to struggle through just give everything I absolutely had, um, which was on the day, not a lot unfortunately, but I mean, you have those days and these are the races that you grow from.